It was the first day of a tactical exercise. We were patrolling and I wasn't concentrating. I was in a, a bit of a world of my own, which is how I tripped and I fell into a stream. <laughs> I immediately felt like a prick and it was like I was down there for ages. Everyone was laughing at us, my mates, the command. I knew I looked daft and it was all a bit of fun, but I could do without it. And I weren't going to stop the patrol. Problem is, an NFCI, it's not like a broken bone. Sometimes you can't tell how serious it is. And by the time we got set up in the harbour, I wasn't too sure. My feet were sodden and I couldn't get my, my hands warm. It was probably because my clothes were wet. NFCI is the most common I could remember our lectures. I knew they were a risk and, and could end a career if they were bad. So I, I replaced my wet socks with Gore-Tex and I put them out to make sure that the, the wet kit would be dry for the morning. I also put on another layer because uh, I knew I was going to be on stag later. On Sentry uh, was the first time that I felt like there was something wrong. Like my hands were fucking cold. I didn't want to say anything. I'm, I'm flying and training at the minute and I don't want to be back squatted. So I sucked it up and continued. The next day, we went back out on patrol. My hands it got worse. There was now a kind of, it was like numb throbbing pain that, that made it hard to hold my weapon. I couldn't control my weapon or, or concentrate. All I could think about was, was how many hours there was still to go. But I knew I had to get it checked out before it was too late. But I, I was still worried about letting down the lads. When the section commander gave us the signal to continue, well, I realised I had a choice. I wanted to push through it for a couple more days to complete my training and prove myself. But I, um, I knew that an NFCI could end my career in, in the army. And being here meant everything to me. I don't want to go home. I, I want to be a soldier. And that's why... In the end, the choice was easy for me. My section immediately understood. Uh, it made me feel stupid about not letting on sooner and uh, risking everything. I, I, I should have fessed up quicker. When I spoke to the doctor, um, he said that it weren't nothing to do with weakness. And if I'd, I'd left it any longer, I might have ended up with painful hands all the time and losing my career. Just. Some people get cold quicker. It's just the way we're built. After I got it checked out, the doc said I'd caught it just in time. And I was back out with the lads, completing my training in no time. <laughs> 